check it out, right? Oh, you're right? talking to me? Yeah, yeah oh yeah, sorry, I'm, I'm enjoying Hey everybody, it's Brian Bernasconi and Dan Rubnitz, the Brian and Dan Silicon Valley real estate team. And we are down here on North Santa Cruz Avenue in Los Gatos. We wanted to follow up on the, uh, the, the, the video that we did uh, a few weeks ago where we talked to uh, um, Councilwoman Mariko Sayoc right. and uh, the town planning department. And we were telling you that they were gonna turn North Santa Cruz Avenue into a one-way street and uh, we are here now a week into this pilot project called Experience Los Gatos and uh, we wanted to follow up and see how that's going. Check it out. We are now here at Juice Co. Los Gatos. This is Emma. We just found Emma behind the counter and uh, we wanted to ask you, Emma, what do you think about this one-way street business? Um, I actually like it. Oh yeah? Yeah, I do. I like it because of the parking, so it alleviates a lot of the lots. In my opinion, because like we have our kitchen in the back, so we have a, we need parking, and I like all the spaces. Um, the only thing is, it makes all the traffic go to university. Right. So and that's has, all backed up. It's been traffic on university. Yeah. Got yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, we heard but, somebody else say that. Yeah, but on here it's not as bad, except on like Saturdays and early morning. Which is on Saturdays. yeah. Yeah. Got How it. about your customers? Have they made any comments about it? Do people seem to think it's People said that they didn't notice it at first, like driving on it, that they didn't notice that there was a difference. Or, like, they noticed something was up, but they didn't, like, grasp. Yeah. Good. Got it. Great. Cool. I'm from Florida, in the Tampa area, in the two cities, Tampa and St. Pete. And they do a lot of this one way, oh. the slam park. And it's, it's easy. For us, it's easy. It's nice. Again, it seems safer because there's only one way that traffic is going. Right. And when you're walking across these streets and there's shops, it's just easier to uh, safety. Safety. So yeah. You obviously, know which way they're going and the parking. You spot it a long time before you get to it. You know where there's an opening. I think it's a great idea. This is Adrienne McGrath. She is the proprietor here at the Villa Galleria in Los Gatos, yes. right? Brand new shop, when did you guys open? Brand new shop, just opened in March. Beautiful shop, honestly. You guys have some gorgeous stuff here. Thank you. Right, we took a tour before and they've got some beautiful home improvement and home decor, uh, all kinds of stuff, flooring and cabinets and appliances and gates and, and, and uh, poles and knobs and tile and it, the list just goes on and on and on. Okay. Fireplaces. Fireplaces. You got, you got everything. Everything. One home improvement shop. and uh, and uh, home decor, and it's a great shop. So we came in here. You getting Dan in this picture too? You got Dan in there. I'm here. We came in here yeah, because here. we wanted to ask you what you think about the One Way Street project, the Experience Los Gatos. How has it impacted you? Because you here are on the One Way Street. So so far, it's definitely been a lot quieter. Oh, like your business has been quieter. Yes, the, the traffic has subsided, yeah. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. You think people are afraid to come down here or what? I think traffic, yeah, deterring people. For sure. Deterring people? Mm -hmm. Interesting. For sure. Okay, what else have you noticed? Uh, parking is hard to get out. Uh, it's because people are driving too fast. People are, did you see how fast Yeah, that guy was really going fast across there yes. right now. Uh, also, there's a backup on um, University from Traffic um, being backed up on university. Yes. Yeah, okay. And the trucks can't turn on us because of the You guys were telling that story. So a truck was coming northbound on North Santa Cruz Avenue and couldn't turn onto Elm. So basically had to continue down the wrong way on a one-way street Correct. just to get out of there. Yes. Yeah, not, yes. not funny. And we've already had a big truck hit one of the uh, park us. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Not this one, but the one for Is the anybody in it? No, thank goodness it was early in the morning. Sounds like some growing pains. We do have, yes, absolutely some growing pains. Overall, do you think maybe it's a good idea to have these parklets and have people hanging out down here and kind of creating this environment for people to be hanging around downtown? I think that it would be good if it needs a little bit of adjusting. Just a little adjusting? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. How's business? 
busy. We're doing great. Good. Are you? Yeah. That's good yeah, to hear. Fabulous. I'm glad great. to hear. It's exciting. And I'd say in summary, I think it seemed like there was kind of 50-50. There's people who seem to really like it. There's people who, some people who aren't quite sure what it is yet. And um, they've got some kinks to work out, but it seems like we're heading in the right direction. One day. That way. It's only been like eight or nine days, so let's keep seeing how it goes. Right. Well, maybe we'll keep it up, Ross We'll come back again in about a month and check it out again, see what yeah. people are thinking. And I just want to let people know, if you like what you saw, please click the like button down below. And uh, if you're on YouTube, uh, Go ahead and subscribe, please. And if you want to get more information about us, www.brianandan.com. That's it. That's, That's really it. it. Cut!